Welcome everybody to the Retro Yuki's VR Chat Zone podcast, where we talk about video VR Chat news, commentaries, and other material. Today, we are talking about the latest update that they just came out with, June 1st, 2023. And it's all about group functionality. Let's have a look. So, the developer update was on 1st of June 2023, and that is based on the beta that's coming out very soon here. So, if you guys are interested in group material, that is for you today. So, the next step of blog, blog upload will be every two weeks, and that will be the next one is on June 15. Next, let's talk about the open beta that's coming up right here. That is now on for testing. So here it is, new group instance type. So if you guys are into the group settings, you can now do a group instance type called group plus and group public, which is right here in the group area. It is similar to friends plus, where you can you can invite other people in the group, but you have to be in the group and it has to be from the permission from the from the owner okay so here is the new the new look of the group area if you guys are interested you, that is good for friends people who want to find new friends of friends in a special way for like friends plus does Group public instances are like public plus instances where you can where you can go for a group like that. And now they actually add a group banning as well. You can now do group ban improvements. So you guys can um do the banning from group if you need to. So yeah, there's a button for you guys there. Okay, group locations, view, and group search. You can now see where everybody else is in the group area. So if you guys are interested in that, you guys can do so there on the social tab of your of your VR chat right here. So group search, that's where they are, your group is like this. And then if you guys are into client simulator, client sim, that is for you. It is now updated for version 1.25. I do not use this. So if you guys use that, congratulations, you got a new update. Which is not working for VR chat video players. They are, they are working on this. So if you guys want to watch Twitch stuff on VR chat for video players, they are working on that. So I got for updates there. Ongoing development is where we talk. They talk about fixes that are on the way, but they are usually one to three months away. Okay, so here is what we got here. More group settings are on the way, including just in, just included. The group instances, bands, and more. Now they're adding more. They're going to raise the member cap of groups from 10,000 to 100,000, which is multiplied by 10. That's very straightforward. They're going to do member search so that you can find e members easily from the group. And they're going to do some performance enhancements so, so, so that your um, FPS can go up. You can also do a setting search coming up. So if you need some help with a setting, you can just search it up on a on a search bar for the settings. Login flow optim localization. Uh, this is for those of you who want to log in. And there's some bugs and fixes that need to be helped with. For example, here are some of the bugs that are on the board. Camera smoothing and camera stab stabilization behind trails behind avatar. We also have mouse horizontal sensitivity is super low. 
threatening someone is and reloading their avatar doesn't enable cameras quick menu and menu and main menu curses jump around when moving in the station Shaking your head while in full body tracking creates body jittering visible from remote users. They're still, they're still working on these. Uh, video players do not work if YTP, YT minus DLP user configuration is present. The camera is unstable at high speeds like in planes. They're working on that. And finally, vote kick notifications. You're going to see when the voting has finished. And that's all for today for the, for the update on June 1st, 2023. The next one, as they said, is in two weeks on June 15th, which I will cover on either that day or... <laughs> Or whatever I can cover it. Okay. So here's what I'm thinking about this. This is actually very good. Because you can see that they're trying to make groups a priority for this particular update. If I, on Tuesday, when we go back on VR chat, we're actually going to take a look at the beta version to see what it looks like. Because it looks like it looks like it could be very interesting. All right, that's gonna do it for today's episode of the VR Chat podcast. If you have any questions about this, or if you guys want to check it out, the blog, make sure you guys check out the description below. I am Richard Yugi, and we'll see you guys on the next one. And enjoy.